Welcome back or welcome to my channel. So today I have another hair review video for you guys. This video is sponsored by I Show Hair. They were kind enough to send me over their loose deep wave 4x4 closure wig. This is human hair by the way. So we're gonna go ahead and jump right into the video. We're gonna start with the unboxing, which I already filmed. So it came in this cute little satin drawstring bag that you see right here. And then it just says I Show Hair in gold in the front. And it says I Show Hair, You Show Beauty. And then inside the bag, it comes with two nude wig caps, a little thank you card with their information on it their website and their email and then it also comes with the wig inside of a ziploc bag and this is a 24 inch wig i don't know if i said that already but this is their 24 inch loose deep wave four by four closure wig and then it also comes the hair comes inside a hair net so i'm gonna go ahead and take it out the bag now so boom this is what it looks like real cute real pretty pattern um it's inside a hair net it also comes with stuffing on the inside and go ahead and take it out it's been a minute since i did a hair video y'all but i had braids in if you saw my last video then you know i had braids in and and yeah, I wasn't able to do one. Plus my birthday this past weekend, my birthday vlog is coming out soon. So y'all stay tuned for that. Thank you to everybody that told me happy birthday on Instagram. Y'all follow me on Instagram. So, you know, you can keep up. So yeah, this is the wig outside of the hairnet. Ooh, ooh, this is soft. This is real soft. Okay. Oh, no tangles. Zero tangles, real soft, no tangles. Okay, okay, this is nice. Okay. And then this is what the front looks like. Like I said, it's a four by four closure. This is not a lace frontal. Now y'all know how I felt about that last closure wig. I did with Eunice hair. I'll link that video right here. I'm just not a fan of closures, y'all. I like my frontals, like my 13 by fours, 13 by sixes, but I'm gonna try it. I think it's just cause I don't know how to really wear it for one. Like I don't know how to install it. And then I just really don't like not having lace on the sides. Like, you know what I'm saying? But we gonna, we gonna make it work. We gonna make it do what it do. So yeah, this what it looks like. And then the construction on the inside. So there's the lace right here, four by four closure, two combs in the front, comb in the back and adjustable strap. And this is a one B or or a natural black wig or whatever you call it. So yeah, I'm gonna install her. Now I'm gonna do two videos with this hair. So this video is just gonna be me installing it. And I'm just gonna tell y'all like how easy the install was and how well the lace melts and stuff like that. And then I'm gonna do another video. I'm gonna try and style it like a different way, try and wear it different or something. And I'll give y'all an updated review then. So like, you know, I have some time to wear it and give like a proper review, you know what I'm saying? So yeah, so y'all can know how it holds up over time. Cause you know, wigs already be, you know, of course straight out the bag, they be, you know, good, most of them. I don't do that with my synthetic units though, because I don't know, synthetic units, I mean, everybody know they tangle up over time. So, you know, but actually this unit right here is from my very first cheap Amazon wig review video. Go watch that video if you haven't already. If you haven't been keeping up with that series, you need to go catch up. Cause I got another one coming soon, y'all. I just ordered three more wigs. Well, actually I only ordered two, but I have one more, the one I wore for my birthday. I got off Amazon as well, so I'm gonna add that one to that video. Video. But yeah, y'all seem to like that series. So I'm gonna keep them coming. But yeah, this hair is from that video. I worn it out once already and I wore it in a video. I can't remember what video that was. I, I think it was that the very first headband wig review video I did. I wore this in the beginning of it. But yes, it hasn't, it's not tangly yet. And also, well, I ain't gonna say nothing about that. Y'all just have to watch that Amazon wig review video when I do it. But I got some details about my birthday hair, but y'all have to watch that video. But yeah, this hair is from that video and it's been holding up pretty well. I mean, I've only worn it once. Like I said, I wore it out once. I installed it. But yeah, and I'm wearing it today. I didn't glue it down today though it's just um i just have the combs in in the front this is that same hair i'm still loving this hair one of my favorite synthetic wigs by far i love this it's so soft and like i said it's not even tangled at all like i can brush it and it's not tangled um only thing i don't like is the ways though but yeah oh by the way make sure y'all enter my giveaway i'm doing a giveaway for when i hit 2000 subscribers and when i hit 3000 subscribers and i'm actually gonna go ahead and throw in the 4000 subscribers giveaway because so i don't have to do a whole new giveaway i was gonna pick two winners this giveaway for one for 2000 one for 3000 but i'm gonna go ahead and add uh the 4000 subscribers to that since the giveaway is not over so i'm gonna end up picking three winners make sure y'all enter because you can pick whatever wig any of these wigs right here you can pick whichever one if you win you can pick whatever you want this one is included in it so um go enter so y'all can win these are the rules right here y'all go enter all you have to do is subscribe to my youtube channel follow me on instagram and answer this question right here what were the two brands i recently got sponsorships from i talked about it in some recent videos so yeah i did that because i want people that actually watch my videos to win i don't want people just subscribing to me just to win giveaways you know what i'm saying or follow me on instagram just to win giveaways so yeah if you can answer that question i know you've been keeping up and i know you've been watching and some of y'all was quick with it too some of y'all was quick and got it right so i seen some right answers so yeah go into the giveaway it ends on friday july 16th and i'm gonna announce the winners on saturday so it'll be in the video i post on saturday which will be a clothing haul so yeah go into the giveaway and make sure y'all stay tuned on saturday 
to see if you want or not. Now let's go ahead and get into this video. I'm actually gonna go ahead and see if this is big head friendly first, but I'm gonna wash it because I be having to wash. I always wash my human hair before I put it in because the first time I got human hair and I didn't wash it because I didn't know nothing about weave. I didn't wash it and I broke out like my whole face, like where, my, where the hair was touching me, like rashes and like on my neck and stuff. So yeah, I had to wash my hair for I wear it. So I'm gonna try it on and see if it's big head friendly first so I can at least let y'all know that much. And then of course I'm gonna do the full review in the next video I do on this hair. Yeah, I'm gonna wash it and I'm also gonna bleach these knots as well and I'm probably gonna pluck it too. So I'm gonna do that and then come back and I'm gonna install it. It's gonna be sped up, I'm not gonna be talking. My install routine is still the same. If you've seen any of my wig install videos, still the same. Um, I'm just not gonna be doing the ball cap method with this. I haven't been doing the ball cap method lately. I just don't be feeling like doing all that. It just be too much. So yeah, I'ma just do like regular wig cap and I'll put the wig on. But yeah, I'ma install it after I wash it, bleach the knots and pluck it. Yeah, y'all will see me then. It'll be sped up, you know, a little music playing or whatever, add a little razzle dazzle. So yeah, I will be back when I'm installing. So I'll see y'all, well, in a few seconds. Girl, what are you talking about? Didn't you just say that you was gonna try it on so I can let y'all know if it's big hair friendly? Let me take this hair off so I can try it on. I try and be gentle with my synthetic wigs too, just so it can last as long as possible. I know these things just start tangling up and acting a fool after a while. I can brush this hair still and it's not even tangling or anything. Still soft, still flowy, all that. I'm gonna put the combs in so it can stay in place. But it seemed like it's big hair friendly because I ain't have no trouble doing that. Yeah, definitely big hair friendly. I did not struggle to get that on at all. Y'all know I got a big head. They already got some points points for me because y'all I be sick of buying wigs that don't fit me I don't understand that why y'all be making wigs like people don't have big heads out here if anything y'all need to make them a little bit bigger and not like a little bit smaller you know what I'm saying so I mean it is adjustable strap on it I mean people that got small heads can adjust it and make it tighter like you know what I'm saying I really think y'all need to try and cater to us big headed folks a little bit more but yeah so this was looking like I love this this is really pretty this um pattern I love this I really hate to wash it because I want it to be like this but yeah I like this it's cute let me see what, um, about the parting, parting space. Okay, the parting go back pretty far. You know, it goes back to here. It's four by four, so it's four across and four back. Okay, and of course you can part it anywhere in this area. You just can't part it nowhere else because it's a closure and not a frontal, <laughs> but it's okay. Okay, so we got that checked off. It is big head friendly. So now I'm gonna go wash it, bleach the knots and pluck it. And I'll be back in a few seconds. Well, y'all will see me in a few seconds for the install.
All right, y'all, so boom, hair is installed. I didn't bleach the knots, by the way, because when I went to go do that, I ain't had no bleach. And I just wasn't gonna go get none. So I didn't bleach the knots, I just plucked it and I washed it. When I washed it, I did get a little bit of shedding. Other than that, it doesn't shed that much so far. Oh, the lace, the lace, um, the lace melted pretty well. I just had trouble getting like the skin color correct. I must then got darker or got a tan or something because the color I normally use did not match and I had to use a darker shade. So yeah, I fixed that. But yeah, other than that, the lace, the lace does pretty well. Parting space, boom. And I just wet it. I'm just gonna wear it like this for now. But I think when I come back, like when I come, when I do the second video on this hair, I think I wanna do that little um, Farrah Fawcett hairstyle. I really wanna try that. And I think I wanna do it on this hair because I like the length on this. Yeah. So I want to try that hairstyle on this hair while I have it in. So the second video y'all will see will be me doing that. And then an updated review of like how it's held up over time. Uh, but yeah, other than that, I'm really liking it so far. Y'all know I'm not a fan of closures, but actually this looks pretty all right. Like this looks pretty decent. So I'm pretty okay with this. Yeah, I'm not gonna do my makeup and everything. But I don't feel like doing all that. I have my makeup on in the last portion of the video. You know, I just didn't... I don't usually, I've only done that once and I didn't like doing that, but I'm gonna install the wig once while wearing makeup. It's just not, it don't work. So yeah, and I feel like doing my makeup after I finish. So yeah, what do y'all think? What are we thinking? I like it, it's cute. I swoop the edges up real nice. I'm gonna take my AirPod out. Yeah, I like this, I'm liking this. Um, I don't know, the last closure wig I had, I just wasn't, like it just wasn't doing it for me. But this is like, I kind of, I, I think I kind of like the closure, but I'm still a little self-conscious about the wind blowing and you see that, like I don't like that. It. that's what i don't like but i do like it looks pretty nice like this you know what i'm saying so yeah i also didn't do the bob cat method with this wig i said that already but um i don't even know how to do a bob cat method with the closure wig because i can't do the bob cat all the way around i mean most people just glue it and then cut that off but don't you have to sew it down see i'm not finna, i'm not gonna do that i'm not gonna do all that but yeah so far i'm liking this wig oh another thing i also like how the ends like you know how some wigs be like it like be looking full and then the ends be completely see-through like what was going on when y'all made that? You know what I'm saying? So yeah, this hair ain't like that. Like it's not like the ends aren't thin and see-through and all that there. So that's a plus. Well, I like this. I like this so far. So yeah, that is all I have for this video today. Don't forget to check out my website, whoshebeauty.com, where I sell my lashes, my big blinks, which are my 25 mm lashes, my baby blinks, which are my short lashes, my lip gloss, my lip candies, my tinted glosses. I have Juicy Watermelon, which is a red tint, Georgia Peach, which is a peachy tint, and Cocoa Kisses, which is a brown tint, which is what I'm wearing right now. These are what they look like, cute little candy tubes, per. I also have clear glosses, regular clear gloss and glitter gloss. Strawberry Kiwi is the clear gloss, and Dice Pineapple is the clear glitter gloss. I also sell bags, little crystal money bags, Bags, cute little quilted mini bags, spring mini bags. I also have face masks. You know, we still in a panorama. So yeah, you need a mask, mask up, even if you're vaccinated, you know? I'm vaccinated, but I still be wearing my mask sometimes. So yeah, um, I got cute little rhinestone face masks that match some of the spring little mini bags. So you can get a mask to match your bag, do it up real cute. I sell jewelry, necklaces, anklets. I sell do-rags that I make myself, handmade, per velvet do-rags. I sell press-ons, these are focus. These are a set I did for my birthday and they're red on the bottom. But yeah, you can shop my press-ons, I sell press-on styles. You can shop any of the styles that I already have on the website or you can DM my business page, Who's She Beauty on Instagram and we can discuss a custom order over there if you want something different. I do accept custom orders, so DM me on my business page, not my personal, my business page for custom press-ons. I also have sweat sets, all the cute stuff. Stop playing. Shop with me, coochbeauty.com, link in the description, as well as my business page on Instagram. And y'all been shopping with me too. I've been noticing y'all. I've been noticing y'all that's been coming from YouTube, shopping with me and following me on Instagram. But yeah, I see you girl and I sure appreciate it. But yeah, I put this at the end of the video because I ain't got a few comments saying that I talked too much in the beginning of my videos. And first of all, I could have swore this was my video. <laughs> But I mean, I get it. I do be hate when people talk a lot sometimes like in YouTube videos, but I just be trying to promote my business. Like that's why I be talking so much. I just be trying to promote my business. Like, you know what I'm saying? I'm trying to get my coin. You know what I'm saying? So why are you hating? Like, why are you, what's your problem? Um, Yeah, I just said I would just start putting it at the end of the video if that'll be more convenient for you impatient, short attention span people. So yeah, but get you some business. How about that? Get you some business. Why are you over here trying to mind mine? Tell me what to do, you know? But yeah, that is it for this video. Thank you to Show Hair for sending me over this unit. And I will see y'all in part two on this unit, a full review and I guess I'll try the fair Fawcett hairstyle. I think that's what I'm gonna do. I might back out cause I don't wanna screw it up, but I think that's what I'm gonna do. But yeah, gonna look out for that video on this same hair. But yeah, that is it for this video. If y'all enjoyed, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe to my channel, please. 
and thank you and make sure post notifications are on so you don't ever miss when i post because you don't want to do that you don't want to do that so make sure post notifications are on and i'll see y'all in my next video bye